Hello everyone, welcome back again to my YouTube channel. My name is Osereme. If you're seeing me here for the first time, thank you so much for stopping by. Hit on the subscribe button down below if you're still here to subscribe to my channel. And also please turn on the notification bell so that you get notified whenever I post a new video on this channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys everything you need to know and every equipment that you need to get for you to start up a YouTube channel in 2023. So if this sounds like something you're interested in, Keep on watching and let's get started. Okay, I love them done, they know Guys, the year is moving so fast. We're in February already and I know a lot of people who probably thought they would have started their channel in January already thinking maybe it's too late. Maybe they should just like give up on the whole dream. Please do not give up. Today, I'm just going to share with you all the basic things that you need to start up your YouTube channel. So let's go straight into the very first one, which is to decide on what you want to film about now you'll be thinking okay i need to start up a youtube channel what do you want your channel to be about what niche are you hoping to go into what type of videos are you planning to film so that's the first thing you need to decide on what type of videos you want to be posting on youtube and once you've decided on that it's going to lead you to the second option which is for you to actually create your youtube channel now creating your youtube channel is actually the easiest of them all because most people already have youtube channels without actually knowing this because if you're able to uh, make comments on youtube it means that you already have a youtube channel now what you need to do to start up your youtube channel is go on google and just type how to start up a youtube channel and you will get every single thing you need to do and once you've created your channel the major thing you will need to do is verify the channel which is also very easy to do so all you have to do is go to youtube.com forward slash verify to verify your channel um create a channel banner put um, your channel name whatever you name you decide you want to use for your channel and i always say if you're a beginner please make sure to use a name that is easy to remember don't make use of a name that is too long for people to actually remember to come back to your channel create a channel banner put a profile picture and you are good to go okay now you've created your youtube channel right the next thing will be filming your first video and to film your first video these are some of the materials that you might be needing equipment basically that you might be needing to create your first video now number one which is like the most important of them all is a camera now you don't necessarily have to get a digital camera to film your first video you can film on your mobile phone um, but if you can afford to get an actual camera please do i'm just saying if you do not have an actual camera for a start you can totally start by filming your first video on your mobile phone so the number one equipment you need to get is a camera and there are so many different types of cameras out there there are some that are very good for vlogging there are some that are very good for um different types of content actually so if you're hoping to get uh, an actual camera you can find the one that works best for your kind of content and buy it but if you cannot afford to get a camera and you really want to film your first video please go ahead and film your video on your mobile phone another very important equipment you will need if you are filming your youtube video is an external microphone now um if you cannot afford this as a total beginner it's absolutely fine you can use the camera you have on your mobile phone especially for those of you who are filming on your mobile phone but if you're hoping to enhance your audio if you're hoping to take your content to the next level i would say get an external microphone i'm using one right now um, i'm currently filming on my mobile phone and the microphone i'm using is actually very affordable so getting an external microphone can really help boost the quality of your youtube video another very important tool you will need to get to be able to effectively post a youtube video is a tripod stand now you need something to help hold your phone in place um, while you're filming your youtube video now this actually depends on the type of content you intend to be filming um, if you intend to film more of vlogs you might not necessarily need to get a tripod as a beginner but as you grow and continue to film youtube videos you realize that there's actually a need for you to get something to help um, keep your phone in one position most ring lights these days actually has that tripod stand so if you have a ring light it's like it comes now two in one so um yeah but you will need definitely something to help hold your phone or your camera while you're filming your youtube video 
Another important equipment that you cannot afford not to have this year is something for your lighting. You must have something to help with your lighting. Now, a lot of people actually film their videos with natural light. If you have a room that has a very big window and you have really good lighting coming from the window, that is very good to start. But if you're in a place that the lighting is not so good, you will need to get either a ring light, LED light, whatever type of lighting you can get, just something to help boost the quality of your videos. I'll say it again and again, lighting is a part of YouTube filming that you must not take for granted. You must make sure that you have a very good source of light for your videos to come out really nice and clean. Another thing you will need to take into consideration if you're hoping to start up a YouTube channel is a good background so you have to work on your background now there are people that actually buy wallpapers uh, really nice wallpapers and put on the wall probably if the wall is not um, so good or probably the wall color is not something that fits um, the kind of content they want to be uploading you can definitely get wallpapers you can get materials cuttings whatever it is you can use to get a very nice background and of course you can sit behind a wall which is actually what i'm doing right now i don't have a, a lot going on behind me i just have my wall and i have like a tiny leaf plant here and that is it just make sure that your background is not too busy and is not distracting people's attention from what you're actually trying to tell them so you must work on your background it is very 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 important now once you're done getting everything in place and you've filmed your first video now you need to have editing software and editing app somewhere you can turn these videos that you have created into a video worthy of youtube now you'll be able to add maybe sounds you'll be able to just put in other things that you might want to put in if you're filming on your mobile phone and um, if it's an iphone there's imovie um you can also download other applications like InShots. um you can download CapCut and so many other apps. There are so many apps, guys. Um, InShot actually works a lot easier. It's very easy to get around and understand for total beginners. So if you're a beginner and you're um, hoping to film on your mobile phone, thinking of what editing app to use, I would say InShot and CapCut. And if you're someone who uses an iPhone, iMovie, these are very easy um, editing softwares that you can use for editing your YouTube videos so guys that is basically all for today's video i think this is everything i wanted to come on here and say today um thank you so much for watching if you're still yet to subscribe to my youtube channel please hit on the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell and if you're still thinking of whether or not to start up your youtube channel this year i hope that this video actually encourages you to pick up the camera and film your first video so thank you so much for watching guys i'll see you in my next one bye